guys to my channel glad you guys made it back i'm cute little voice i hope you cuties are doing okay today so today will be a wig analysis on this gorgeous braided unit right here and before we get started i want to share with you my makeup i did my makeup look from the sweet pinks um juvia's place and i really really do like it um so yeah if you guys were wondering about my makeup but yes today um is a wig analysis on this gorgeous Brady unit right here. This one is everyday friendly and also this is good for the fall and the winter. Uh, this is a very lightweight unit um, but it has a lot of hair but again it is very very lightweight. So let's get into this wig. This is from Newborn Free. This is Magic Lace Front Wig. Um, Magic Lace Front Wig Bray Wig 38. And I have it in a color FS4 slash 30. So this is the stock card, but it doesn't have any photos. But of course you see the wig on my head. So let's talk about the cap. The cap is a big head friendly cap. Um, very stretchy, you do get two combs at the side, one in the back with the adjustable straps. The, the braids are very, very neat. I love the way they are constructed. Very, very nice Fulami braids. I do have a tan cap underneath. You can go in with a black cap if you would like to, but you just have to add some lace tint underneath the cap. It does come with sparse baby hairs. They look very natural. I just kind of swooped them over. Um, as far as the texture, this is a soft, yakky texture, very soft, and as you can see, I'm running my fingers straight through this one, um, no shedding, I'm sorry, no tangling, but um, it does shed some, at, at the beginning of me wearing this unit, um, it did shed quite a bit, um, but now it has died down. Now it comes in an updo. It does come like this. Um, you can take this out if you would like to and um, wear it all down if you would like to. So this one is saying that it's 38 inches, but actually it's um, about 22 inches. So let me give you a 360. I'm gonna pull all the hair to the front. This all the hair is quite full without being too overwhelming. So the luster on this one is a nice healthy luster. It does not look dry or anything like that. You can uh, go in with some wig shine if you would like to, to kind of um, give it more of a luster. So I'm just going to add a little bit to it to kind of give it more of a sheen look. And this stuff smells so good. I can't stop spraying it. Um, so if you were interested in this one, uh, you do get a few colors. Actually, you get a lot of colors. So I'm going to go to um, name them pretty fast. You get the Arbon Red. You get Blush Pink. You get Sugar Blonde. You get uh, Brown. You get Red Wine. You get Queen Blonde. You get your regular colors, your FS30 and your FS430 like this one. Um, so this one is just a good one to have. It has no smell. You can't see any tracks or anything. The hairline is pretty natural on it. Doesn't look bad at all. So yeah, I really, really do recommend this one. Um, now, it wasn't pricey at all. I got it on sale, but I'm sure it's still inexpensive. I'll leave the link down below. And again, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye-bye.